On Wednesday, political observer Sable Ali Aghali called on Prime Minister Mohammad Shia al Sudani to end the work of the United Nations representation in Iraq, indicating that if this matter were achieved, it would remove Iraq from Chapter 7. Ali Aghali told Al Malma, the time is right for Sudanese to ask the Secretary General of the United Nations to end the work of its representation in Iraq, especially after Plaskayet announced the end of its mission in Iraq. He added, Plaskayet's request to end its mission and the Chinese representative's recognition of the existence of a state of political and economic stability in Iraq gives al Sudani the opportunity to ask the Secretary General of the United Nations to end the work of the United Nations office in Iraq or at least reduce it, and then Iraq will exit Chapter 7. The representative of the Secretary-General of the United Nations, Jeanine Plaskayet, had asked the Secretary-General of the United Nations that it was her mission in Iraq during her periodic briefing at the UN Security Council yesterday, Tuesday. It is noteworthy that Iraq has been subject since 1990 to Chapter 7 of the United Nations Charter which was imposed on it after Saddam's regime invaded the state of Kuwait in August of the same year. This clause allows the use of force against Iraq as it constitutes a threat to international security, in addition to freezing large amounts of its financial assets in Iraq. International banks to pay compensation to those affected by the invasion.